internet. How you doing? Hi, right. internet. Yeah. So I saw a crazy Japanese video where people were putting, oh, that's a good shot, putting rubber bands around a watermelon. And uh, I've, I'm quite thirsty for watermelon right now, so we're going to cut one open using the classic Japanese method by the sounds of it. Here we go. Start doing it. Yeah? Yeah. Just pile them on. This might take a while. This could take some time. Chipping at the top as well, and the sides. Oh, it's starting to crack everywhere. Ooh, it's perspiring. Oh, ho, ho. oh. <laughs> <laughs> bloody hell! It went, yeah. severed it in half. <laughs> wow! Oh That's incredible! <laughs> the ball of rubber bands just went over there. Where'd they go? I want to find that. Oh, it's over there, look! <laughs> <laughs> All of these elastic bands were wrapped around it and uh, it just sort of, it was started leaking water, like dripping everywhere and then it just gave up. Just yeah. <sighs> we were just about to put more on and then it, it just, like all the rubber bands just turned into a rubber band ball and shot out, yeah. leaving well, the melon. I, all I saw with my own eyes was this. Yep, yep. <clears throat> and that was just... It's like a, how to cut a melon perfectly in half. That. Look at it. Do you reckon if you did that to a human head, it would eventually like cave in? Eventually, yeah. <laughs> oh, it's stuck. Oh, 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 it went. <laughs> hit me in the head. Fully <laughs> <laughs> hit me in the head. Good noise there. Good noise. Good scoffing sound. Now, listen, listen. Oh, do that again.